Sometimes when you see the slavers and they're killing you, you say a lot of weird things. You know what we need right now? Yo, pay to win Giola. You know what? That's what I needed. 100 bits from a stove, 100 bits from Giola. Alright. You guys got me. You got me. I'm sandbagging, alright? Give me 100 bits. This win right here. Thank you. You paid for it. You guys can thank Giola and Soap is a Stove. And how we started off? Uh, Sparkle Snipe. Is it the best play? Probably not. Is it the coolest? Definitely. You ready for this? What do you want, Papo? You want you trying to guess something? You ready? No fight. Yes. Ooh. Oh, no fight. Oh. That's actually pretty bad. I could just die right here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that's pretty bad. All right, let's hope we do well right here. Jesus. Buddy, don't eat that. I believe, I believe, I believe. No, no problem. Wow, this is very good actually. Say what you want, but we got Sharon's Ashes, Feed, and a Mummified Hand. This is very, very good. Alright, so to rest or not to rest? If we rest, we can... We're forced to do an elite. Uh, we're gonna have to... Okay, we might just add this elite, but if we survive, then there's a lot of potential for this run. Like, a lot. Frozen egg and this? Come on. It doesn't get better than that. Be kind to me, please. Come on. Come on, come on. Oh, wait! Cherry's Ashes in this fight. Thank goodness. Now, we just wanna get a feed, and then once we get the feeds going, we're gonna be a-okay. -okay. This is perfect. This is all I want according to plan. I know I could have killed the guy on the left, but I'm trying to set up... Okay, that was a mistake. I should have done... Okay, that was a mistake. Because I was trying to... I could have set up feed for this guy, and this guy... I would have taken a lot less damage. I, okay, I made a mistake. I did. I admit it. Mistakes were made. That was a 5 damage mistake. I'm waiting for block. I, I want some more block here. Let's upgrade feed right away. So if we can get feed going, then we're a-okay. We see make sure we have damage for Hexaghost, which right now I don't think we do. It's a great, great start to a run, though. It's gotta give me feed. I'm holding out for feed. Charon's Ashes, no! Wait, I just realized Charon's Ashes... Oh, he's attacking me? That's fine. I gotta get feed next turn. Please, 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 please. Yes! Battle Trance. We need... We need, um... Maybe Armors is not bad, but we need to get something really promising here. Feed here. I killed the, killed the guy on the left. That was my bad. Not bad. That's actually a really good fight for us. And we're already getting nice feeds going on. 
Very good fight for us. Let's hope that we can handle Hexaghost. Corruption evolve. Really? You're trying to give me corruption with the potential to just dump all of my skills at the second half of the fight with Cherry's Ashes? Is that what I want to do? I don't know. I mean, it's a great, great little combo. We've done this before. Hmm. Hmm. I just don't know, though, because we're going to get burns and... Sh like, what, are, what is our deck doing? I can't afford... Okay, we have to do a really big third pot. It's going to have to be third pot play. It's all in third pot here, guys. I'm, I'm going to have to put the mic down. We're putting a lot of math into this one. Block or not to block, you know I've been in a situation before. To block is a mistake. That's nine damage, and I'm gonna be two damage off lethal, and I'm gonna regret this. But that's eight to my face. Who's to say? Mm. I'm going for it. We're gonna have to get Sarah Pie at some point. Not now, though. Okay, Sarah Pot now. At, on this turn, right here, right here, right now, right now. It's twin Strike, please. Oh, God. Twin Strike, please. Ha! I believe, I believe, I believe, I believe. Oh my goodness, no, stop. Stop. Okay, that fight is over. No longer worried. I was really worrisome. You guys couldn't notice, right? I looked totally calm. Wow. Black Star, Runic Dome, Runic Pyramid. Hmm. Runic Pyramid is interesting with Mummified Hand to get energy reduction because of Mumford Hand and powers, right? And then we can set up and hold on to our powers. Like, once we go... Once we go get the Corruption out and then Dark Embrace, we just unleash the beast and have a feast. And we can hold on to feed. Tell me if I made a mistake. I hope I didn't make a mistake, but... I hope I made some good points there. Mumford Hands, beast, feast, and feed. All those things together. Seems pretty good. Bum bum bum, bum bum bum. Come on, feed. I'm. You're gonna be the saving grace. I wanna have so much max HP. It's not gonna matter. Let's go now. I'm popping off now. Ready, set, go. Yes. Let's go, baby. Okay, I probably should have wasted that one energy, but whatever. All right, time to go for the feed. Let's go, Feed. I believe in you. 19. Yeah. Okay. That's, that's going to be great. Warcry is not bad, right? Well, it's another skill. So it's important that we get some skills so the corruption doesn't run dry.
it's important that we get some skills so corruption doesn't work to run dry, but Warcry is pretty dry in itself, especially unupgraded. Zero Brazzy, how you doing, buddy? You too drunk? Hey, take care, buddy. Just, uh, be responsible. Be responsible with that drunk the drunkenness. Although a drunk person wouldn't understand what that means, right? They'd be like, what are you talking about? Today, today is Friday, you're right. Oh, fuck. Uh, let me see here. A lot of gold. You be safe. Maybe I don't care about the damage I take. I mean, I do, but like, maybe not that much. Feed. It's all about getting feed, 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 feed. Spot weakness. Yes. Please. Wait, can I go back and flame with Mom at hand? They're both similar in that spot weakness gives me multiple recursion, but also gives me corruption fuel for dark embrace. Okay, but inflame gives me energy with Mom at hand. Oh well. Ooh. Wait, what? Double two? Havoc is pretty good with what the deck wants to do. Leaves Waffles not bad. That gives me f massive heal. I'm talking massive. Wow, 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 wow. Are we in the, are we in the mood for some Waffles? Every time we exhaust the card, three, da three damage to everybody. Remove a strike here. Oh, rah, 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 remove a strike here. Thank you for doing business. It's been a pleasure, my friend. We are ready to do elites, guys. How many? Give me a number, guys. Number of one to three. One to one to four. Give me a number. One to four. Boys. Hey, 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 hey. Pass me that beanie. Hey. 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 Hey, hey, hey. Four, three for the win. So we got one, two. That's crazy. No, 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 no. Let's take it back, all right? Let's go back to maybe just doing... Yeah, one elite seems the safest, right? We go here. Get some nice campfires. Over here we get... I'm going for two. Duplicate a card in your deck. Oh god. Duplicate feed? Is that good? Or is it duplicate... No, I made a mistake. Because if I did inflame, duplicate inflame would have been good because it's another power, more energy prompt, more energy gain. But, okay, duplicate feed seems to be... For multi-target fights, I mean, I'm gonna be beefy, beefy, beefy. Beefy, beefy, chatty boy. For the boss, doesn't help. Maybe spot just helps more for the boss. My bot okay, one second. Enough. 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 Stop. Let it go. Drop it. Drop it. Drop it. Shh, shh, shh. Drop it. Drop it. Hey. Drop it. Hey. Drop it. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Mm. No, they're just playing. They're playing with my beanie, though. Double feed. Double dark embrace. Draw two cards. It's ridiculous. 
Dropkick Infinite. Dropkick Infinite is a play. Problem with Dropkick Infinite, we need to get a way to exhaust the strikes. Well, I went 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Dropkick Infinite. Baron Humbert. Silent but deadly, this man. You guys should watch out for Baron Humbert. I made a few words. Powerful words, though. Very powerful. Wow. Raphael, how you doing, buddy? Wow. <laughs> no, I like I like the plan a lot. Big fan of the plan. Oh, I love it. Oh my god. Say it ain't so, darling. Today we're going infinite. Even if it gets us killed. I mean, but then there's this. It's a power. It's upgraded, modified hand. It's quite nice. Ah. I think we go for inflame, but three drop kicks with a deck that has corruption, drag and brace, and the potential to go infinite with bash and uppercut. Tough to say. Maybe two drop kicks enough. I can Havoc something, like this for instance, although, I, I'll, I'll be honest, that needs to be upgraded ASAP, that needs to be upgraded ASAP. Oh, we got feed. Interesting play here. So I could do drop kick. Oh, check this out. It gives me energy. Holy macaroni. Why didn't I consider how beautiful that was when I had drop kick? Had a free strike. Our deck is insane. So four elites. Uh, so we're doing four elites. Uh, is that confirmed? Yes, it is. Whirlwind for AOE. It's pretty nice. It shores up some of the. But we have AOE with technically with corruption. Uh, corruption shards ashes. Now, Headbutt's very nice, because I like the ability to recur. Hey, thank you for 250 bits. Then it was the last mistake. Yeah, exactly, you see? They they thought they had me the first time. No, no, no. I'm back. This time I'm Iron Chad. Okay, uh, Headbutt, though, what can I bring back? I can bring back Dropkick stuff. Two leads, sir. Two more leads. Zoom would be nice. Fiend fire would be nice. Uh, a lot of these would be very nice. Double, double, um, double havoc here. It seems worrisome. I know you're worried. Don't worry. 
It's all okay. Do not worry, my friends. I wish Havoc... <laughs> Alright. Oh, I had lethal with Strike. I didn't think about the exhausting. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not sharp right now. I'm not sharp. If I was playing chess, I'd be losing. If I was playing chess right now, I'd be losing. Oh, baby. Let's go, 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 let's go. Non-stop, non-stop. I'm going for the feed here, am I? No, because I don't want to take damage. I'm sorry, I'm greedy. I'm greedy because there's a lot of elites we're going up against and I don't want to take damage and this is not the time. How much life did I... So, how much life did I save there versus how much I would have gained from feed? Yeah, maybe it was right to do feed instead. Uh, my bad. Disarm. Bag of prep. Oh, buddy! Yikes, this is a great hand, but also a little bit problematic considering that we're taking damage. Okay. Oh, corruption is great. So we just win now. We just got a block and we win. Alright, we just win. GG, next time we win. Alright. That at least taken care of. Who do I want to feed? Uh, let's see. How about I do this first? Alright, and we're going to feed this guy right here. Now, if I did feed on the last fight over there earlier, then we would have been... Whew. It would be 4 max HP richer, but um, it's okay. Gotta be a little careful with these kind of fights. So I can get a free defend here. I can have free, because I have it needs to be upgraded, by the way. I also should be I should have done probably this earlier. But we're gonna get feed here, and that's gonna be our 15, 19, 34, plus a nice Okay. Alright, and Max Tree is going to carry us to the victory, even though it seems Sentinel's going to be fantastic. And, okay, I was going to go for another Elite, but at this point I think, okay, we have Juju, okay, there's two uh, events. I mean, we probably get another Elite. The thing is... Oh, another 150 bits. How many times do we need to teach the lesson on man? <laughs> Defense and events a lot, and also, we have potions, though. It's important that I find corruption now. It's important that I find corruption right now. I also want to bring Sentinel back though. So I should probably, uh, honestly, I should have kept Headbutt in the hand so I can do Headbutt Sentinel once corruption dark embraces out and then I just win the game off of that. But for right now, what I can do is bash. All right, we got corruption, so that, that's very promising.
close. Feed on him, we win. Now, last time I didn't feed on you, little buddy. All right, I spared you, and I shouldn't have, because I would be a lot healthier. But this time, I'm eating your little gremlin booty, and I'm loving it. All right. So now we got Armament's headbutt and thunderclap. Well, headbutt's amazing in this kind of deck. Dragon base headbutt recursion is just. The things dreams are made of. It's incredible how good Dark Embrace, Corruption, and Headbutt are. It's, I can't stress it enough. Now, keeping the deck small is very something to consider as well, because if we don't get into our powers, then we're doing bad, so we're going to skip. Now, we can rest here. If I rest, well, I don't need a rest, actually. I think we're going to... Well, okay, let me see. I think get rid of his artifacts. And once I do the Corruption shenanigans and get all that out, once I do that... Am I gonna have enough staying power? I think I will. I think I think we'll be fine because I think we're gonna have a lot of strength. We're gonna have inflame plus spot weakness plus the ability to do drop hit, drop hit, drop kick shenanigans, and we have free turns in between every other attack. And we also have um, twin strike, and I think disarm is okay. Disarm. I don't know how much I can depend on that. I think we'll be fine. We have also kunai as well. I want to upgrade Havoc for sure. That's, that's the that's definitely want to upgrade, but I'm trying to see if 30 HP is enough. Do I, do I have enough damage? I feel like with this Inflame and Spot Weakness, our damage is going to be plentiful. As long as... As long as we can make sure he gets vulnerable quickly. You know, honestly, I think the, the, the worst thing that can happen to us is like... There's a chance that we don't have enough or quick enough, so let's just get rid of that chance. Am I regretting? Am I regretting not upgrading Havoc? Yes, but... Well, I don't regret it just yet. It depends on the outcome of this. Here, here's the situation. Here's the dilemma. I want to get this guy's artifacts out of the way. Uh, I should probably just do plated armor here. That was a mistake. But it's very important that I get this guy's plate armor out of the way. And now, I guess here we don't care about what we Havoc. Getting rid of Headbutt is kind of unfortunate, but as long as it's not... Like, I, I don't care that much. So we can do Corruption now, or we can wait. So we can do Spot Weakness first, and then Corruption, and then we get a lot of Strength. Or we can just do Corruption now, because I think 11 Strength is more than good enough for me. Or maybe I don't have to do it. I don't want to full do it. Like, I don't want to... Go super ho YOLO ham kabuli. We got disarm, and you know that was gonna exhaust anyways. And if we can just like maybe kill these things, all right, that was gonna exhaust anyway, so that's totally fine. And now we're feeling okay. Like okay, I don't maybe have to fully block because we have. Well, we want to get maybe kunai. I could block one more time, or I mean I could do another strike. Oh, Dark Embrace isn't the thing. That's been bad. Um, we're, I mean, I feel like we're about to go pop off. Because we have 11 strength. We have bash, drop kick. We have a lot of things. But maybe I want to hold on to some block. Just just a little bit. So we're going to go ahead and take this damage here. And now we're going to go start popping off, hopefully. That's the game plan. That's the game plan here. As a matter of fact... Yeah, we're good. And we're going to start killing him right here. Or at least we see what we can do. Now, now we get rid of all the block because I could do Kunai first. But we're just going to win here, I'm pretty sure. Now, I could have held on to feed. I was being really greedy. Now, did I need to rest? Did it need to, well, how much life did I lose? Uh, I lost at least 30, right? I don't think I need to rest, but uh, it's okay. It's all good. The barricade works really well with this. I like it. Curse key, crown. Ooh, less cards to choose from. But do we care about cards when we have this deck? I mean, okay. It's only Act Three, so I'm not taking crown super early. It's not as bad, but this deck would want more. We've got some good components. We have Disarm for the heart after he buffs. We've got some Strength Gain. 
we've got the ability to go through our deck and do a lot of AoE and do a lot of big burst turns with Corruption Dragon Brace and Barricade on top of that. We have a lot of gold, so if we hit a shop, we can buy a lot of cards from the shop or buy a relic from the shop that would maybe be nice. Curse Key, okay. Um, at least it's open. This is the ability to find cards still. It gives us some curses. Do we care about curses? What's the most we're going to get? Probably one or two curses from Curse Key. It's guaranteed one curse, yes. But that's to say... What if we find a Mori or something like that? I think... How much do I have value cards right now? I mean, I think with the amount of gold we have, I'm happy with taking Crown here. Max HP is wonderful, guys. Max HP wins. I'd tell you guys that the way to win Ironclad is Ascension 20, Act 4 Heart. Um, in fact, I think that the last couple, uh, the last two Heart kills I've gotten in Ironclad have been 120 plus max HP or something. HP is amazing. Feed is so good. Feed is probably top three card to Ironclad. Feed is top three card. Corruption is top five card. I didn't get to see the path. One sec. This is fine. We can go for multiple elites, actually. We can go for like shop, elite, elite, elite. I get three elites here. But we'll, we'll see. I'm trying to get feed here. My goal is to get feed. Feed every fight and we win. Unfortunate. Sets me back. Unfortunate. You son of a gun. I had three strikes. You choose my army plus? Oh, see, now I feel like this might not be worth it though. Because it's a little too late, I would say. I mean, I would have to save 230 plus, like 230 gold ar around that much to make it worth it. Mm, it cracks Small Bank early. Maybe, maybe we don't want to crack Small Bank. What about Panacea, though? Panacea opens up Steroid Pod shenanigans. I don't know if it's worth it, dude. I don't know if it's worth it. Because it's like, okay, I buy this. There's two shops. There's a shop coming up and a shop there, but then I would have to save like 200. <laughs> big switch trick? I think the big switch trick was 2 0. 2 0 defect, um, runic pyramid, back to back, science, science list. I, I always fail the 3 0. I like the Panacea. Let me see. Membership card though. Another thing is to crack it over here. Crack the. Fine. Panacea though. Yeah. Removal? Fine. Jeez. I can't say no to that. I don't mind that good like block. Just another... No, I don't want the deck to be too fat. I like to think it ahead for the card draw, but... Oh, I was going to go for another elite, right? I was going to go for another elite. I messed that up. I actually want to go for okay another couple of elites here. How do you feel about metallicize? I don't even think it's that good.
I'm gonna win this easily. Give me a second. Corruption now. Ah, uh, one sec. Infinite. Who likes infinite? Do you like infinite? I like infinite. We all like infinite. Ta -da 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 -da. Oh my goodness, Paper Frog? Sentinel? Sorry, Sapphire. I'm sorry, Molten Egg. Da -da 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 -da. Alright, we win this one. Just get, we're trying to get feet here. Pendant. Uh, guys, we're getting so much max HP too, it's ridiculous. Paper Frog as well. Okay. This Elite, no problem. Oh, yes. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. Everything I think about this is yes. Yes. Hello. Okay. The only thing is I want to weaken her. And then we're going to go ahead and Sharon's Ashes these guys. Hopefully. The one thing we lack is AoE because Sharon's Ashes is not quite enough. We want to find Dark Embrace first before we do Panacea. You want to find Dragon Brace first? Okay. Hmm. Uh, if, if I do feed on these guys, and I kill the guys on the right, left and right, and then if we do block, block, block. So let's say we do like this, and then we do block, block, block with Kunai in the picture, and then we just go. So we don't get feed, unfortunately. Maybe I should have saved the feed. That was my bad. I there's. Honestly, objective, there's no objectively no reason not to save feed there. I just missed out on another 4 max HP. That was really stupid. Hope that doesn't bite me in the butt. More offerings. Gyria, why not? We'll lift. Well, I want to upgrade card draw because I want to find the corruption, dragon base, all that stuff. Well, this is also not bad to upgrade as well. It's also not bad to upgrade. We could just we we'll just recall now. Though we, let's um, I want to do another elite. Ooh, more corruption. War one seems interesting though, because we have options. We have, sometimes we have like a lot of energy with Sentinel, and we have Pen Nib, right? And we have a lot of energy, and we have Strength Gain with Spot Weakness. So I think War one's actually pretty decent because we often have Pen Nib energy and Strength Gain. It's another skill, more block. Do we care about the ability to dump? Well, we also have uh, Dropkick Infinite, right? Thorns? No. We could do Stary Pot for the artifacts against the heart. So I can get rid of the weak pot, and, but we can keep one Stary Pot for that. Now we can lift or we can go for... I think card draw is important, right? So either this or this. But maybe even... Th no, but these all get rid of themselves. I honestly don't think I have anything good to upgrade. Uh, I missed out 4 HP, you guys, with the feed. Uh, man, I'm never, I'm never gonna let that down. I'm gonna, have, I'm gonna sleep with that in my mind tonight. I'm just kidding. It's not a big deal. What do I want to do here, boys? So many options. This arm. How did I forget? Oh my god. How did I not see this arm? This arm is obvious. So obvious. Ridiculous. Uh, in fact, I don't have to play here. I could have brought back, um, 
I got a weak pot there, dude, but I can also brought back the spot weakness. It's probably a weak pot last turn. That would have saved a lot of life. So we're gonna play. One thing you gotta learn about this fight is that you don't wanna play corruption prematurely like I've done in the past. You wanna play Dragon Brace though. But you wanna try to maybe hold on. So we can kill this guy with like well, if I get rid of my skills, I get drop kick infinite, right? So let me think about this. Wait, uh, let me change gears. Drop kick infinite. This fight doesn't punish that at all. So I don't want to get rid of bash. Well, we have uppercut in the deck, so that's fine. So whatever I have here is totally fine. Drop kick infinite now. Yeah, drop your infinite now. Do not care about any of these because I have uppercut. Do not care about any of those. Don't care about any of those. This is how you win the baby. This is how we win it. Time to yak and he sacks it up and then feed for the win. Who's next? Corruption now. No. This fight's a little bit difficult, but we can do Dropkick Infinite as well, so let's actually rush right into that. It's important that we get both of them. we got to get their artifacts out of the way, so this could be Dropkick Infinite as well. Um, we got to be quicker with this one. In fact, how many days do we have already? We already have two days, so this is a little bit harder. We don't have to rush it though, right? Let me see. Do I go now? I mean... If I go now, what are the chances I can kill the guy in the back? I need uppercut back. Oh, 
Okay, heart. That was fun. Lift or upgrade? Lifting, it seems so. Yeah. I can rest. That's 20. That's, not, that's uh. That HP is relevant, the rests here. Although, what would we upgrade here? I mean. Can't beat the heart? We'll show you. We'll show you, Wolfles. You can still combo the heart. So, what's important about the heart is that. Um. We'll have two, we have three turns, right? So as long as we can guarantee we do 200, 400 damage in the first, the, the, we have to survive. This is how it works. We have to survive um, first couple turns and do damage at the same time. And then we will have two free turns, sometimes even three, to do 200 damage each turn. So once we do the drop kick stuff, we can do 200 damage there. And then the next turn he's attacking, but I do 200 damage there, and then he dies. So it's, it's particular in a way that... Disarm the way the one I use it is gonna be very important. That's gonna actually save me a whole turn. So we'll just play it. We'll, we'll see. It'll be fine. Oh, disclaimer: it may not be fine. This is pretty relevant, right? Like that heal could be kind of nice. The heal could be kind of nice. Fire breathing. <laughs> Fire breathing to kill the guy on the left. The no, 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 that's stupid. Um, I guess go pot and true grit is the play here. Or maybe a blood potion. Blood potion seems to be alright. So I guess it's a decent heal. True grit seems uh, maybe a little unnecessary too, though. Alright. Don't want to make the deck too fat because the deck's operating pretty well. So here's what we're going to do we're going to put this corruption now. Corruption now? Corruption now for free? Where's Dark Embrace? Get fucked. <laughs> Headbutt. I like it. I do like it here. Most. <laughs> he said he's popping off. That's the most subtle pop off. Like. Super low energy, get fucked. Oh my god, the pop off! Silent next, yeah, we'll do Silent next. Uh, I, I like how, but, but I think we have already one in the deck, two in the deck, two in the deck, right? Well, the recursion is very nice. Let me see. You have one in the deck. The recursion is very useful, but I think we can skip this one. Okay, uh, I'm gonna try hard. I'm gonna put the mic down for a little bit.
Since when did I bottle turn a barricade, by the way? Could have done Sentinel. I'd rather get rid of the wounds here. Stereopot, Stereopot, Jeremy. Oh. It's GG now. I forgot about that. Don't want to disarm now, I want to disarm after the effect. I, I could dead to his big attack next turn though. I'm probably dead to his big attack. I'm probably dead to his big attack. And I don't have a way for this, like I don't have rage for drop people to do anything for me. Yeah, I don't have rage for drop people to do anything to me. Yeah, I think we lose. Because I realize I can't do drop kick with... I don't have rage. I think we lose. Yeah, we lose here. There's a chance that he... I need to have... So there's a chance here. Now the chance here is that... Alright, okay, here's my chance. Here's my chance. If I have it now to his bash, I'm happy. 50% chance to hit bash. I'm very happy if it hits bash. Extremely happy. Drop kick, no. Bash, yes. It's too high risk. But if I can hit bash right now, then next turn. Well, I wanted to hit Bash.
We still have luck. We can't win. One. Wait, wait, Orikakum wins. Orikakum wins, dude. I need to do, I need to do 51 damage right now. How much was that? Let's go. Let's go. What's up, YouTube? Whew. Math. Hmm. Oh my god. Ori Kalkum, you're amazing. Whew. That was rough. Oh my god, not even close. I gotta take a breather after that one. Thank you for the 100 bits. I gotta go take a shower.